What's up everybody? Today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak and unlock your iPhone's second gen on firmware 3.0.1. Now all this firmware does is really fix the Apple bug for the SMS text messages. But since I'm doing it, I might as well show you. Uh, after you have restored your iPhone second gen firmware 3.0.1, the next thing we're going to do is go to our city or excuse me, Red Snow on our computer that we've saved. I will have all the information for all your baseband bootloaders and firmware that you'll need to do this. Now that you've downloaded everything to your computer, we're going to go ahead and open up Red Snow. Now, all we're going to do from here is search for our correct firmware. Now doing this, you are going to install the firmware 3.0, not 3.0.1 to do this. So go ahead and install 3.0 firmware. As you can see, it's going to search and it has success successfully identified it. After doing that step, go ahead and click Next and let's do this thing. Okay, it'll bring us up to here where you get the options of installing Cydia, IC, and only on the second gen iPhone you can unlock through Red Snow. Me personally, I'm not going to install IC. It will be Cydia and the unlock. After you click that, go ahead and click Next. From here, it's going to bring you up to search your computer for the correct baseband bootloaders. Again, I will have all the information on where to find these bootloaders. Um, first bootloader we need to search for. Go ahead and do that and install the second one. After you have both bootloaders and found them on your computer, go ahead and click Next. And from here it is telling us, make, please make sure your, your device is both off and plugged in. As you see, it is plugged in, so we will turn it off. Go ahead and just turn it off. Make sure it is completely off before you do go to the next step. On the next step, we will be using the home and the power button to do it. So therefore, I'm going to need to set the computer down to show you, but I will wait till it's completely off. <clears throat> okay, now that the iPhone second gen is completely off, we will continue to the next step. We'll set the phone or camera down and hit next. Hold the home but power button, home and power button. Release the power button, continuing to hold the home button. And the jailbreak will start working. As you see, the phone has went to a DFU mode. And it says install downloading jailbreak data. Continuing to hold the home button down. As you can see, the computer is doing its thing. And it says downloading jailbreak data. From here, you could go ahead and let go of the home button. And you can see here, it's telling me it's done. I will wait until the down jailbreak has continued to do its complete process before I go any further. Now, it's installing and patching all the files I am going to need 
for the jailbreak on 3.0.1. From here you can go ahead and hit finish and close out Red Snow. And we will be waiting only on our iPhone second gen. Now I have made a video on the iPhone 3G how to do this. It's basically done the same way as this without the bootloaders. Um, to get those on the 3G or 3GS you need to go into Cydia. But that's on a different subject. As I have here is my 3GS and I will be doing 3.0.1 jailbreak and unlock on this as well. I haven't yet but it's coming. So that will be the next thing. And as we continue to wait for the iPhone second gen to finish its jailbreak. And we are getting closer. Again, if you do have any questions about anything, feel free to ask, message me. I'll help you out any way possible. As you see, our computer, our iPhone second gen is rebooting. Again, once you do any type of jailbreak or anything like this in iTunes, restore as a new device. And here we go. The iPhone second gen running on T-Mobile. See here, there is Cydia. And to show you, I am on the correct firmware. Right down there, as you see here, 3.0.1. And that is the jailbreak and unlock using the iPhone 2nd Gen. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. This is First Shift. I'll see you later.